The question here is given a trigonometric uh, equation that is 1 plus sine square is equal to 3 sine theta into cos theta and we have to prove that tan theta is equal to 1 or it is equal to half. Now what you can observe that we have uh, the information given in sine cos and we have to obtain tan. What we know from here that uh, tan theta is actually sine theta by cos theta. So that's what we are going to do here. Now we are going to divide each of this with cos square. So this is 1. So this is 1 over, I can write this as 1 over cos square theta plus this is sine square. I'm dividing it by cos square, each, both LHS and RHS. So this is again cos square theta plus, no, that's an equal to sine. This is 3 times sine theta into cos theta, which is the numerator that divided by cos square theta. Now I can figure out that here one cos get cancelled and what do we get after that? This is 1 over cos square which is what? Sec square. So we have sec square theta plus this is sine square by cos square. Uh, you should know that is uh, sec is 1 by cos. So that's what I did. Now this is sine square by cos square which is equal to tan square theta. And this side we have 3. Once again we have sine by cos so that we can write as tan theta. Now check except for this sec square we have all in tan. So we can even convert this sec square in terms of tan square. So using this relation. So I'm writing this sec square theta as 1 plus tan square theta. This is 1 plus tan square theta plus this is tan square theta is equal to 3 tan theta. Now figure out that we are frame going to get a quadratic equation. Let's write down the quadratic equation. This is tan square plus tan square that is 2 times tan square theta minus 3 tan theta plus 1. Now we can find the solution of this equation but uh, quadratic equation but for a uh, to make it easy, what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace this tan with y so as to make it easier for us. We are, what you are going to do here is simply writing tan as this tan as y. This way it will be easier to simplify. This is 2y square. This is 2 times y square minus 3 times y plus 1 is equal to 0. Now I'm going to do middle term factorization or splitting splitting 3y as 2y minus y plus 1 is equal to 0. Now we can check here that further if I reduce it I can see that there is 2y common so taking 2y common we are getting y minus 1 and taking minus y common minus 1 common from here that's y minus 1 equals 0. So that is y minus 1 and 2y minus 1 equals 0. Now equating this with 0, equating this with 0, we'll get y is equal to 1 and equating this with 0, we are getting y is equal to half. Now check here, y is what? y is tan. So therefore, I can write, replace this y with tan theta and we can say that tan theta is equal to 1 and from the other part, we can say tan theta is equal to half. So we'll say that this is what we had to prove and we have proved this.